Babs, here comes the next fastest finger question and the last one of the night. With these bodies of water in geographic order, starting in California, going east. Great Salt Lake, Mediterranean Sea, Persian Gulf, Mississippi River. <laughs> Are you almost done, Chevy? No, no, Time's wait. Up. <laughs> Let's see the All answer. I got was AC. <laughs> in the correct order. Starting in California, going east. Great Salt Lake, uh, Mississippi River, uh, Mediterranean Sea, and Persian Gulf. That's the right order. Who oh, did it at the fastest time? Let's oh, hold it. the parents all these great movies yeah. congratulations thank you very much you finally Reeves. got out of there and got i know up here. no stop downs let's go good for you let's go for it who wants to play it uh, who wants to be a millionaire well ben stiller does for his charity what is the charity project als project als yeah. right here it is one hundred dollars right now someone who is mentally unstable may be described as not playing with a full what b menu <laughs> <laughs> deck Band, head of hair. Okay. That would be B, deck. Final. Yes. Full deck, right answer. $200 coming up. Which color hey. light on a U.S. stoplight signals go? Red, <laughs> yellow, green, periwinkle. Mm. Got to go with C, green. Final. Yes, final. Go means green, green means go. You got it, baby. He's going for $300 right now. A fast-talking, aggressive businessman or politician would most likely be called what? Wet blanket, wheeler dealer, whippersnapper, incumbent. <laughs> uh, I, I guess uh, it seems like that would be a uh, wheeler dealer, B. Wheeler dealer, the right answer for yeah. $300. That was a, that was a the oh, two of you. What a team. <laughs> Sunshine boys in a couple of years. I see it. <laughs> Good evening, everybody, and welcome to night three of Celebrity Millionaire. Last night, we kicked it off into high gear with Jason Alexander and Edie Falco, both winning a quarter million dollars for their charities. And tonight, Ben Stiller sits right here. Nice to see you again, Ben. You too. And Richard. others are waiting patiently to get in that seat. Big, big stars like uh, Chevy Chase and yeah. Martin Short. Yeah. Two of the original three amigos. Yes. Okay. The smartest amigo, obviously, not here. Tonight. Not here. <laughs> no. yeah. My co host, Kelly Ripper, whose baby is expected any moment now. She's being patient. Dennis Franz, who threatens to go nude if he doesn't get into the oh, hot seat. Oh, He's being patient. And wonderful, wonderful Alfre Wooded, whom I called Alfred all night last night. And I'm so sorry about that, my darling. Anyway, thank you all for coming, everybody. Great to have you here. We're going into night three with Ben Stiller. Good to be here, Regis. We oh. love you, Regis. <laughs> <He's, he's, laughs> I don't need to say anything. You don't have to I'm say anything. Neither, neither one of us do. We're here for you, Benny. We're here for you, Ben. <laughs> so, Ben. Ben, yeah. Ben, Ben. All of a sudden, you know, there was Ben Stiller. And, uh, but, but I think the film that really brought you to the public's attention was uh, the cult film uh, Reality Bites. Is that, am I right? Well, that was kind of, well, yeah, I mean, that was 1993, and that was kind of the first movie, I, it was the first movie I directed and really kind of uh, was in, in any major, I'd done a lot of little parts in yeah, movies. Yeah, sure. Lots of little ridiculous roles. And now suddenly you're in everything. Yeah. How many movies do you, do you make, man? Um, I... Try to make as many as possible. Uh, as many as you can. <laughs> and you're succeeding, too. And you're playing for ALS, uh, the Project ALS. Yeah. You mm -hmm. know, uh, very few charities get repeated on this show, but suddenly the two of you came in. Yeah, I had no idea that Edie was playing for Yeah, Edie also. played for last night and won a quarter million dollars. Yep. And, and Put the tonight, pressure on. Put you're the pressure involved on. as well. And we have um, the co-founder of uh, the organization up in our seats right now. We talked about her last night just briefly, but didn't have a chance to say hello. Uh, Valerie Estes, how are you? Hi, Regis. Tell us a little bit about this project. 
Well, this project was founded a few years ago when my sister Jennifer was diagnosed with ALS, which is a close relative of Parkinson's and Alzheimer's. Mm -hmm. And uh, Ben is helping the world to know more about it and helping scientists to put some uh, medicine in place, and we need it very badly. And uh, Edie helped out in a big way yesterday. How did the field go home with that checklist? Oh, it, we, were, we were flying home, basically. And your sister's reaction? She, she just wanted to send love to Ben and Edie, and Ben, she just says, you're the champ, and you have been from the get-go. You're awesome. Awesome. Well, you man. There you go. All right, that's what it's all about tonight, Ben. Okay? Project ALS. If you want to try your hand at this game, just unplug the phone, stick the cord into the computer, log on to abc.com right now, and play our enhanced TV game. You shouldn't be taking any calls during this show anyway. All right, Ben has won $300, just 12 questions away from winning $1 million for his favorite charity. You have all three of your lifelines left, Ben, 50-50. You can ask the audience and you can phone a friend. Ben, are you ready to play this again? Huh? I'm ready. All Let's right, audience, are you ready? Yes, we're all ready. Let's play. Who wants to be a millionaire right now? Okay, Ben, here we go for $500. Which of the following words best describes a shishi restaurant? Mediterranean, dark, cheap, trendy. Oh. <coughs> well, Nij, I've, I've been to a few shishi restaurants. And they're usually dark, but uh, mainly I would say uh, they're uh, trendy. D. Yes, $500. Trendy. Right answer. Okay, Ben, here it is for $1,000. A dozen dozens is called what? A gross, score, Google, brace. Walk away. Whoa. <laughs> Walk away. Wait a second. Mm. A dozen dozens. A dozen? A dozen dozens. Mm. <clears throat> I, I'm, you know, I'm really, I'm feeling like A is probably the way to yeah. go with this one. Just because yeah. that's my gut. Go with your gut. I'm going to go with my gut. Final end. Yeah. Right. You yes. got your gut. That's right. $4,000. So happy. All right, Ben. Five down, All ten right, to okay. go, two thousand dollars. Here it is. Uh, what comedian created the film character known as the Little Tramp? Buster Keaton, Harold Lloyd, W. C. Fields, Charlie Chaplin. It's, I'm thinking that's Chaplin. That's my oh, feeling yeah, when yeah, I yeah, think yeah, about yeah, this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like most people feel it's Chaplin when they think about yeah. this. So uh, yeah. I'm going to go with D. Chaplin. And Chaplin is your yeah, yeah, yeah. final answer. Final answer. Yeah. E. Chaplin, the yeah. right answer. Charlie Chaplin, the little friend. I feel like I'm getting tougher, lower-level questions. Really, do yeah. you? In a weird way, but maybe just because you're sitting in the hot seat and it feels tough. Oh, yeah, yeah. it feels okay. a little different. Okay. Yeah. But now, right here yeah, it comes. the little tramp's yeah. pretty tough. <laughs> <laughs> you're the little tramp for a new generation. <laughs> Thank you very okay. much. Good to be here. 4,000, Ben. <laughs> yeah. Since 1994, who has hosted the award-winning TV talk uh, show Inside the Actors' Studio? Rex Reed, James Lipton, Larry King, Charlie Rose. <laughs> Uh, I, I know this one. Uh, it, it's not. Uh, it's not Rex Reed. It's not Larry King. Uh, it's not Charlie Rose. It's James Lipton. Final B. Yeah. That's who it is. Yeah. James Lipton inside the Actors Studio. Does a terrific job. Here it comes now for eight thousand dollars. What city's current mayor is the son of former mayor Richard J. Daley? Chicago, Boston, New York. Detroit. Yeah. Uh, that's uh, that's pretty clearly uh, the Chicago uh, mayoral dynasty there. So I can say A. Yeah, a, a final answer. Yeah. Uh -huh. Chicago daily one of the same. You got it for eight thousand dollars. Okay, Ben, we're up to sixteen thousand dollars. Right. What legendary figure does Mel Gibson portray in the movie Braveheart? William the Conqueror, William Blake, William Wallace, William Tell. Uh, all right, my uh, my brother-in-law Brian Taylor. It's his favorite movie, Braveheart. And I know that if he was here, he'd probably tell me it was uh, William Wallace. See, so I'm gonna. Uh, you gonna go with that? I think I'm gonna go with. Make that Wallace. your final. Yeah. 